Good morning from the island like no other. Welcome to Four Park. My first ever theme park vlog of 2020. Have an awesome day. <laughs> yeah, if if you haven't seen my last vlog from Warwick Castle, check that one out. So basically I'll take you all around the attraction, all that, show you what there is. It was a really great day. Hey, you on YouTube. Hi. Attractions Hub, check it out. <laughs> yeah, so the first ride I'm gonna go on is Nemesis Inferno because that always has the biggest queues. And obviously, of course, I last filmed the vlog here, July 2018. And yeah, that was the last time I was here. And um, yeah, a lot of things have changed. So obviously we've had the Walking Dead, the ride, which opened in 2018. And um, yeah, so it's been a lot really. And of course, considering this is a Merlin Park, you can't film on the rides here. So I'll share plenty of off-ride footage in this vlog. And of course, I'll share my reviews of everything I go on. And yeah, so the first ride I'm gonna go on is the Inferno. So I'll share off-ride footage of the ride. And then I'll see you when I come off. See you in a bit. All right, so I've just come off Nemesis Inferno, and wow, it's so good to be back on some roller coasters again. How was it? Woo, great! Yeah, so, so good. It's, I mean, it's so, so smooth. I mean, that's what I expect from a b &M. It's so, so smooth. It was intense as well. It wasn't rough at all, so... Yeah, so the, the next ride I'm gonna go on is Stealth, the Intamin launch coaster. So, again, I'll share off-road footage when I get there and I'll see when I come off. So, I have just come off stealth and wow, what an intense ride that is the launch is insane yeah the oh, words cannot explain how intense the ride is so right so what do you plan to go on next uh, that one. what swarm yeah. yeah oh yeah the swarm is such a smooth coaster it's so so smooth so yeah so swarm it is then so i'll share off-road footage of the ride and i'll see you when i come off so i just come off the swarm the bnm wing coaster wow smooth as anything so so smooth it's been open for eight years oh here we go oh, it's done some off-road footage Okay, so as you can tell, I just come off tidal wave, drenched, absolutely drenched. <laughs> oh well, it's a hot day, it's worth it. <laughs> there you go. So yeah, I'm not sure what ride I'll go on next, but whichever ride I choose, I'll share off-road footage of it, and, and of course the usual, I'll see you when I come off. So I have just come off Rumba Rapids or Thor Park and actually I, I actually I actually didn't get wet at all really. I didn't get wet at all. It was a really good ride, so yeah. And again, not sure what I'm gonna go on next, but again whatever ride I'll share off ride footage and I'll again see you when I come off. Alright, so next ride we're going on is Day Bombs Away, which is a which is a drop tower manufactured by Fabry, so yeah. I'll share off-road footage of this ride in action and I'll see you when I come off.
Okay, so I've just come off, detonator bombs away, the, the, the Fabry drop tower. Really, really good drop tower, but it's not as forceful as, as, as Hurricane Condor at uh, Port Aventura World in Sulu, but still, decent Fabry drop tower. So yeah, and now the next ride we're going to go on is Colossus, the, the, the ten inverted roller coaster manufactured by Intamin and I'll share off-road footage, so see you later. Nice. So, yes, so we have uh, just come off Colossus. I'd say uh, back when I first rode it in July 2018, yeah, it was a little rougher because I was near the back, but that time, wow, so, so smooth. So, so smooth. Where's us? Well, where's me and you? Which one's ours? Can't see us. And on. Uh, I oh, can't see this. Oh, that's weird. Anyways, yeah, that was a lot smoother than last time. A lot, lot smoother. So, yeah. Oh, would not it? like, what ride are we gonna go on next? Okay, so, okay, so yeah, whichever ride we decide to go to. Again, I will film off-road footage and I'll see you afterwards. Right, so the next ride I'm going on is Vortex, which is a KMG afterburner. I've, yeah, I haven't been on this type of KMG before. I've, I've, the only KMG rides I've been on is a free cow and a speed booster. So yeah, I'll share off-road footage. And yeah, I'll see you when I come off. Before you submit to the cyclonic forces of Vortex, you must be aware of the following information. There is a minimum height of 1.4 meters to ride, and you must ensure you meet all the ride restrictions as displayed at the ride entrance. Shoes must be worn on the ride, and you should secure all loose belongings prior to boarding. Bags and loose items cannot be taken on the ride. And storage boxes are provided in front of the control room. Dotation guys and ride all good bars have been released, have a relocked and rechecked shortly. You must be aware of the following information. There is a minimum height of 1.4 meters to ride, and you must ensure you meet all the ride restrictions as displayed at the ride entrance. Shoes must be worn on the ride, and you should secure all these ornaments prior to the
Triple Door Cortex, the, the KMG Afterburner, and wow, the best KMG ride I've ever been on. Whew. I mean, yeah, the when you swing, like, when you get, like, really high in the air, wow. And, and you get some proper air time when you're in the air. Yeah, so I think now, I think what I'm going to do now, I'm uh, going to go have some lunch. Probably at uh, Inferno's Peach pizza pasta maybe or somewhere else I don't know but yeah so I'll, I'll have some lunch and then we'll go and do some more rides see you guys later right so the next ride I'm gonna go on is for the ride there's now a Euro fighter coaster so yeah I will see you guys when I come off I'm gonna have these like he is oh actually it's been delayed I mean, it says it's delayed, but people are going in, so yeah. So I'll see you when I come off. Okay, so I've just come off, saw the ride. Yeah, it was all right. Jolting places, but it's an all right coaster. Yeah, not the smoothest coaster in the world, but it's all right. Ooh, that. So, not sure what ride I'm I'm gonna go on next, but. Let's uh, let's just wait and see. So I will get back to you guys whenever I choose a ride. See you later. Right. So the next ride I'm going to go on is Rush, the SNS Screaming Swing. So I'll I'm sorry if I'm saying so a lot of time, guys. I just that's a lot of fun out. So I'll share off ride footage and then I'll see you when I come off the ride. So I've just come off Rush, the SNS Screaming Swing, and wow. Man, the airtime. Jesus. Really, really insane for that. So the next one I'm going to go on is the Hearst Enterprise Zodiac. And I'll, I'll put in some off-ride footage, probably after I come off. And then, yeah, I'll see you after the ride. So I have just come off the Hearst Enterprise Zodiac. Really, really, really good. And now I am going to go on Quantum, which is this magic carpet ride. So I'll see you when I come off. Okay, so I've just come off Quantum, the magic carpet ride. Real, real good. Short cycle, but still good ride. So anyways, yeah, I, I think now I'm just going to do some re-rides of, of, yeah, of all the rides that I can do. So yeah, so I'll see you guys whenever, I guess. See you, see you later. So since I've last spoke to you guys, I have uh, I've actually done a a, a couple of re-rides on, on my favourites, such as Inferno, Swarm, uh, yeah, Inferno, the Swarm, Colossus, and all that. Yeah. So yeah, I, I don't know what else I'm gonna do, but if I'm uh, yeah, I think if I decide I want to do some more rides, I'll do them. But if not, I'll head I'll head towards the dome, maybe buy myself a bit of merch, and then probably wrap up this vlog. So so whatever I'll do, yeah, I'll I will see you guys later.
So it has come towards the end of my day here at Thor Park Resort. Yeah, that was a bit Scottish, isn't it? <laughs> Anyways, yeah, I've really enjoyed coming back here, riding, riding some coasters. I've, I've got two new ride creds, Vortex, the KMG Afterburner, and Death Charge, which was amazing. So yeah, highlights. I mean, really, the main highlight is just being back here, to be honest. And yeah, I've just had a fantastic day, really. So that is the end of this vlog from Thor Park. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Apologies for the episode said, you know, the famous SO word, God knows how many times. I apologize about that, guys. Something I can't help. So, anyways, hope you enjoyed the vlog. Leave a, don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Probably leave some comments down below on whatever type of content I should do on this channel because I've mainly just been doing vlogs. So, yeah. So, anyways, hope you, hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And keep living, keep laughing, keep riding. See you in the next vlog. Bye for now.